The star we're looking at is called Kepler 70 or KOI 55. This star has two planets orbiting around it, but one of those planets is the most weirdest planet scientists have ever discovered in the entire universe. We'll discuss the planet in a bit. Right now, let's talk about the star. This star is about 4000 light years away from us. It used to be a main sequence star just like our sun, but around 18.4 million years ago, it went through a phase called the red giant phase. So what is this red giant phase? Perhaps that's a topic for another video, but for now, all we need to know is that during this phase, a star can expand its size to over 100 times temporarily. What is interesting is that the two planets orbiting around this star are really close to the star. So you can imagine what would have happened when the star became really big during the red giant phase. Initially, the two planets were gas giants similar to Jupiter or Saturn in our solar system. The planets had a solid core in the center surrounded by gas. But during the red giant phase, the star stripped away all the gas. In fact, at one point during this phase, the star became so big that it engulfed the two planets. So essentially, during this stage, the two planets were inside the star. Usually planets die when they get engulfed by their star, but for some unknown reason, these two planets survived and made it alive. After being super big during the red giant phase for a little while, stars shrink and become smaller again, which is exactly what Kepler 70 did. As the star contracted and became smaller, the two planets no longer remained inside the star. But what remained of the planets were just the burnt up cores. Now, although the planets are not inside the star, they are still extremely close to their star. In fact, the closer planet called Kepler 70b or KOI 55b is so close to the star that it takes the planet around 5 hours to completely go around it once. So a year on this planet is just 5 hours. Needless to say, this planet is going to be super hot. The temperature on this planet is hotter than the surface of our sun. Kepler 70b is one of the hottest planets astronomers have ever discovered in the entire universe. You might be thinking, cool, but why does it matter to us? Who cares? It's just a random hot planet far away from us. The scary truth is that our sun will go through this red giant phase too. And our sun will expand its size so much that the sun's outer surface will be where Earth's orbit is. So when the sun reaches this stage, Earth will essentially be on the surface of the sun or inside it. And of course, we humans would have vaporized long before then. We can take some comfort in knowing that the sun will not go all the red giant on us tomorrow. It's going to take our sun more or less 5 billion years to reach this red giant phase. And on that positive note, I would like to end this video and once again, thank you for watching. I'm gonna step off the limb now. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind.